Now let me call a very powerful guy from Germany, uh, Peter Gellis. Who is the editor of Angevante Himi, Peter. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Good morning, everybody. As the editor of Angevante Himi, I give special greetings to today's hosts from the Chemical Society of Japan and the Tokyo Institute of Technology, as well as to the illustrious speakers of this very special symposium. Why do we celebrate 50 years of Angewandte Chemie in Tokyo, in Japan? 2011 is the International Year of Chemistry, as we have heard, and it happens that we publish the 50th volume of Angewandte Chemie International Edition. The journal has changed its face over the last 50 years a lot. And on the left hand, oops, sorry. And on the left hand side, you see how Angewandte looked 50 years ago. On the right hand side, you see a cover of the very special issue that we published on the occasion of this symposium. And uh, the cover picture was kindly supplied by Professor Keske Suzuki from the Tokyo Institute of Technology. Thank you very much. I think this is a wonderful picture. While the face and the layout of the journal have changed drastically over the years, the motto has not changed ever since, and it is quality first. This has made Angewandte Chemie truly international, and the increase in submissions from Japan over the last decade alone gives a clear indication. The number increase from below 300 in 2001 to over 800 that we expect this year. And if one looks at the accepted manuscripts, uh, again here you see that Japan ranks number three in all of the published articles uh, just behind the United States and Germany and ahead of China and ahead of uh, the major European, other major European countries. This, the impact of Japanese chemistry is enormous as these numbers demonstrate. And this makes very clear why we celebrate today with you. I thank all our authors, referees and readers in Japan for their trust and support and particularly the Japanese members of the International Advisory Board. And in chronological order, they were or still are on the board, Professor Ryoji Noyori, Professor Seiji Shinkai, Professor Eiji Nakamura, Professor Suzumi Katagawa, Hidagawa, and Professor Masakatsu Shibazaki. A scientific journal has served both its readers and authors. And while the readers want to be informed and inspired, the authors expect visibility and recognition. And the next picture shows the most famous author and reader of Angewandte Chemie. It is perhaps the first time that this picture is shown in public. I have received it recently, and I'm most thankful to Jeff Seaman who provided it with me. And uh, what's the journal that R.B. Woodward is reading there? And perhaps you can now recognize that uh, some 50 years ago in the early 60s, uh, the only journal on his desk was Angewandte Chemie. We are proud and thankful at Angewandte that we have such eminent chemists as R.B. Woodward, as loyal have and had such eminent chemists as R.B. Woodward, as loyal authors and readers. A couple of them, we have the pleasure to hear later today, including Professor Noyori and Professor Sharpless, who received the Nobel Prize just 10 years ago, and Professor Akira Suzuki, whose Nobel medal is still brand new. And I'm pleased uh, to tell you all that in the brochure that you have uh, in uh, your materials today, there are the Nobel lectures of these laureates uh, reprinted or actually pre-printed in Professor Suzuki's case. He had not seen it uh, being published before because it was not published. This is a 
preprint. Uh, and I think all of the Nobel laureates will be happy to sign their lecture. So uh, if you want to take a remembrance uh, issue, just to walk up to them and have it signed. Uh, I finish with expressing my deepest, my deepest uh, thanks on behalf of the editorial team of Angewandte Chemie and on behalf of the editorial board of Angewandte, of the journal, led by Professor François Diederich, who will also give a lecture later today. Furthermore, on behalf of Wiley VCH, a 90-year-old publishing house founded by the German Chemical Society and represented today by Dr. Eva Wille. And on behalf of the 204 years old, renowned international publisher John Wiley and Sons, represented today by Dr. John Wormsley. These thanks go to the Chemical Society of Japan, to the German Chemical Society, the Tokyo Institute of Technology, and the various funders and sponsors whose names you will find in the program. Thank you all for coming, and let's have a great day. Thank you.